Hi, my name is Carrington Patton and this is my Christian Witness. I have many interests and hobbies, but the verse that got me through it all was Joshua 1.9. This is my confirmation verse and it states, Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. This verse helps me understand that I don't have to feel discouraged or feel like I'm not good enough. And I know that he's there for me all the time. I believe that Jesus died for me on the cross to forgive my sins, and I know he, that he loves me and that he cares about me. One way that this verse has helped me is when I'm anxious or stressed. It helps me realize that God is with me and that I have nothing to fear or get worried about. He has a plan and he's going to help me get through whatever I'm feeling nervous or anxious about. A verse that connects to this scenario is Matthew 6, 34. Therefore, do not worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow has its own worries. Each day has enough trouble of its own. This verse connects to my example because... A lot of the time I was anxious or worried about the next day or something that is going to happen in the future and it would kind of consume me. I didn't need to be worried about it though because God is going to be with me through all of it. I also love sports and running. I play soccer, cross country, and track. And when I first started, I got really nervous and anxious before my meets and it was not good. It would definitely affect my racing. And this verse helps me realize that God is with me throughout the entire race and before the race in preparation for it. And he wants me to be strong and run my best race because he's always going to be with me throughout the entire race. So this verse helps me understand that he's going to be there and it helps kind of comfort me too. Philippians 4.13 goes with my sports connection because it says, I can do all things in Christ who strengthens me. This shows that I can do and achieve anything through Christ, through Jesus. I can play that soccer game and I can run that meet through him. Another way that this verse has helped me is when I'm in a new place or when I'm doing new things, which I'm going into high school this year and I'm going to be trying out for the high school soccer team and it's definitely a new experience for me. So this verse will definitely be important in helping me guide me through my high school year and all the new places that I go through, all the new experiences, and it'll just kind of give me some comfort in knowing that he's there with me, he wants me to be strong, he doesn't want me to be afraid. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you, not to harm you. Plans to give you hope and a future. Jeremiah 29 11. This verse is uh, something that connects to having a new experience or going to new places because it shows that God has a plan for us and no matter what, I'm in his plan and it's going to work because it's God's plan. This verse helps reassure me that in these situations, God's plan is what's going to help get me through it and he wants me to be strong and courageous throughout that and his plan. I just want to thank my parents, Pastor McLean, Pastor Statler, and Pastor Hauser, and my church in general. I'd also like to thank Brandon and my friends for helping me grow my faith and helping me to truly understand what Jesus has done on the cross for me and to know how he's impacted my life.